Guys, so over the next few weeks, we're going to be doing a bit of an upcycle with you. Um, we picked up this old writing bureau on Facebook Marketplace um, and the description of it said that it had been previously upcycled and it is, is quite nice, quite nice colour. A few handles missing, needs a bit of work. Uh, the front of it has come off the hinges, have completely off, so it's, it's going to need a total facelift. Uh, so there's quite a lot of paint on it, so much so that you can't really open the drawers and when you actually look there, when you chip that back, we've maybe got about four coats of paint on it, so it's quite thick. So it's not going to be the, the straightforward uh, paint job that we thought it was going to be, but we actually thought this is quite a good one because it's a, a bit more of a challenge and I'm sure a lot of you have a lot of old um, furniture at home like this that's maybe got layers and layers of paint on it. So we're going to go through with you, we're going to completely strip it back, uh, back to the bare wood, uh, take everything off, we're going to give it a, a, a total revamp. Um, just before lockdown we had a decotage class and two, two of our lovely customers, Michelle and Kerry, um, had came along with this uh, lovely Harry Potter wallpaper that they got in B&M and I really liked it so I went and got myself some. Um, so I'm kind of thinking that uh, we're going to kind of give it a bit of a Harry Potter makeover. Um, so the outside, I think the outside we're going to go with Panther, which is quite dark. And maybe do a little bit of Frenchine stenciling um, on the outside. I haven't quite decided how we're going to do it yet. Um, the inside, I'm thinking we go with Funky Dora and it'll match the map. So we're, we're going to totally give it a revamp. So bear with us over the next few weeks and um, hopefully it's totally transformed and it's a bit better looking than it is now.